Welcome Amazon business owners and soon to be Amazon business owners. Amazon came out with an announcement two days ago that I've been expecting for years. No surprise to me that this has happened. Uh, we saw it coming here at All Go Online Retail and I just wanna do a quick video to talk about it. Uh, by the way, some people are freaking out about it because Amazon said, according to the headlines, hey, if you're a third party seller, you better start working weekends. And all these brand new third party sellers on Amazon are freaking out because they think, I gotta start working weekends. So let me show you a couple of the headlines and why uh, we saw this coming at Algo, and it's no big deal. It's no big deal. In fact, it just makes Algo's Amazon business model that much stronger, that much of a no brainer. Uh, so let me share my screen and show you a couple articles. Uh, the first article here is from the New York uh, Post. Let me get up here on the screen. Um, all right, so we got the New York Post here, right? Uh, forgive, forgive the ads along the screen. Here's what they say. Uh, Amazon tells third-party prime sellers to start working weekends. So people brand new to Amazon are saying, hey, wait, I don't want to work weekends. That's why I'm selling on Amazon. I want to have a, a great lifestyle. I want to sit at my house uh, and not touch any products and be able to sell on Amazon's platform. What's going on here? Uh, all right, so that's kind of the scary uh, headline. Let me show you one from Forbes that's a little bit, uh, uh, gives a better explanation in the title of what's actually happening here. Uh, and let's talk about it. Um, all right, so uh, here's Forbes's headline. And you see the date on here, August 18th, uh, 2020. So Amazon to tardy sellers. If you can't meet prime demands, it's time to start working weekends. All right, so here's what, what Amazon actually uh, announced. First of all, let me kind of show you a couple things in the article. Amazon is putting sellers on notice. If you say your products are eligible for Prime and will be delivered in one or two days, you better do it. Now, a lot of you out there are thinking, hey, wait a second, I thought Amazon did the shipping. They have all these warehouses, they got the trucks. Uh, I'm not doing the shipping. All right, so if you're brand new to Amazon, some of you already know this, but if you're brand new, Amazon has a couple different shipping op options. So there's FBA, Fulfillment by Amazon, and then there's seller fulfilled. So what Amazon is talking about right here is seller fulfilled, seller fulfilled. So let me go down the article a little bit more. All right, in the seller fulfilled prime program, they're telling seller fulfilled prime program members to begin shipping items on weekends. Uh, and it turns out they've actually been doing a horrible job, right? Uh, fewer than 16% of orders from third party vendors in the US who purport to offer Prime actually meet the two-day delivery promise, even prior to the pandemic. So 16% before the coronavirus started. All right, so here's what's happening. People that were shipping from their house, they were doing seller fulfilled, but they promised Amazon they would get it to you fast, two-day shipping. So what they did is Amazon let you put that little Prime next to your name, little Prime next to your name. Let me actually show you, uh, make sure we're on the same peer page here, uh, what I'm talking about. And again, if, if you're brand new to Amazon, uh, let's dive into this. Uh, okay, so here's what happens. When you go to Amazon and you find a product, uh, let's look at this product first. So <laughs> I was actually looking at this product because you know my kids are, are back in school and they got these little uh, desk uh, protectors. Go around your desk and you don't breathe on each other. But anyway, when we get to this product, you'll notice something here. It doesn't say Prime. Over here, it says the price, doesn't say Prime, and it says a shipping date out into the future about 10 days. Okay, what do we like to see as buyers? We like to see Prime. So here it says Prime, says Prime, when am I gonna get it? I'm gonna get it two day shipping. Uh, this is fantastic, right? That's, that's what we like to see, Prime. Uh, all right, so here's what is happening. Seller fulfilled items like this, down here it says ships from and sold by really good stuff, unique name, right? Uh, ships from, uh, from and sold by really good stuff, they're telling Amazon, hey, we're not gonna get it in two days, so don't put Prime next to our name. We're not gonna get it to them for 10 more days. In fact, it won't even ship for two or three days. We see it there. All right, but if you as a seller shipping from your house, you can go through a process where you promise and you agree and you fill out some paperwork and you tell Amazon, we're gonna get it to people within two days, and then Amazon lets you put Prime next to your price, next to your name, et cetera. Well, it turns out Amazon is getting sick of people not doing it. As the article says, only 16%, right? 16% uh, 
of those that have that prime next to their name are actually getting it to you within the two days. So Amazon is now, has announced, hey, we're not doing that anymore. If you wanna put prime next to your name, seller fulfilled people on Amazon, you need to actually get it to people uh, within the two days, within the time period. Now they're giving those people a few months, got a little time to make those adjustments. All right, but I've been seeing this coming for years. Uh, and here's why. When we sell products on Amazon, first of all, I'll go our business model. If you've watched our videos before, if you've heard me before, we talk about selling name brand products. Buy name brand products at a low price, mark that price up on Amazon, sell high, uh, but the key is in selling name brand products. And then you're gonna use Amazon shipping. You're gonna use FBA to enable you to win the buy box. That's, that's our business model. By the way, if you wanna know more about everything I'm talking about here, I'm gonna do a webinar. There's a link right down there. Click on that link, get registered, I'm gonna be live. All right, so Amazon's getting tired of people not shipping on time. They're cracking down on it. Uh, again, I've seen this coming for years. All right, so I'd love to see you on that webinar. We'll go through how everything I mentioned in this uh, little video works, how fulfillment by Amazon works, how seller fulfilled works, how the buy box works. If these are all new terms to you, if Amazon is new to you, join the webinar. If you've been selling on Amazon, but you've been having some trouble, love to talk to you as well. So click the link, get registered. I will be live. I'll go through a time-tested proven business model. And then at the end, we'll have a live question and answer period. So I'm excited. I'll see you then.